Hey everyone, it's Sean here. I'm super excited because I got to try out the ODG Augmented Reality Smart Glasses. Now, as you know, I'm a huge HoloLens fan. I've been using the HoloLens for a long time. So I was really excited to try out the ODG and see how it compares to the HoloLens. Now, special treat, you will also be able to see what it looks like because they allowed me to record the video through the glasses themselves. So what I was amazed about, first of all, is that the resolution is quite sharp. And the field of view, in my opinion, is a little bit bigger than the HoloLens, although it's still quite noticeable. You can see the box uh, around the image, which kind of shows you what the field of view limitations are. Uh, now, what this didn't do is it did not have tracking. So you can see these glasses were bolted in. I was able to move the glasses around a little bit and it did not track its environment. Now, I did talk to the associates and they did say that uh, that would be an optional add-on that you can kind of clip on top of the glasses. So that would actually make the glasses a little bit more bulky. I was able to also try it on freeform. You can see here they were giving demos for people to try it on. Now in the freeform demo, it was not augmented reality, it was virtual reality. So still a semi-transparent view, but it was more of a VR experience where you could kind of move your head around and look at a video. So overall, I do like ODG's vision of having a much smaller headset. Few other observations. One is that the image did appear to be sharper. However, I could actually see the individual pixels. Whereas with the HoloLens, you can't really see the individual pixels. Personally, it's hard to make a good comparison without seeing the full tracking capabilities, but I'm leading towards the HoloLens displays. Uh, the other thing to note is that their proposed price point is much lower. It's half to a third of what the HoloLens costs. Uh, so overall, you know, I do love seeing that there's competition in this space. We're seeing a lot of headset announcements at CES this year. Do stay tuned. I'm going to be cranking out a lot more CES videos. If you have any specific questions about the specs or any other questions about these glasses, feel free to ask me in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer as many as I can. If you haven't already, like this video, subscribe, and thank you very much for watching.